Bow. Floppy drive. With floppy drives, what what you want to do on a floppy drive is you see this kind of like the sides here, like this comes up. See this little notch? Yeah, that little notch. If you get you like a sharp instrument, you can push that up. And it's all over this thing. So see? I kind of pulled it from right there. There we go. Inside the floppy. Is it dusty? Yes. The dust is dust ola. Do I want to see? I don't. I, I'm one of those guys. I refuse to like get new stuff. Uh, like if if I try to keep the original or whatever I have, you know, like uh, um. If I have the, if I had any original anything, I want to keep that. Now you see this black thing here with this. You're gonna end up lifting this up when you get in here, right? And you get in here with like a uh, Q-tip. You see that like silver thing? That's the head. Think of that as like a, a tape head from like back in the day. Yeah, what you do is like all around in there, it's going to look dusty, right? But you don't want to remove the dust in there. Why not? I'm not talking about the tape, the head, not that little white thing, that silver white thing. No, I'm talking about, you see that kind of like cable, uh, orange cable looking thing on the inside of all that blackness? Around all of that is like a, a, a lubricant, some type of lubricant. Um, and you don't want to remove that lubricant because that's what's going to allow your floppies to go in and out smoothly. Now, if you look at top here, this thing is still dusty. Not as bad as it was, but it's still dusty. Is the front still dusty? Yes. What I would do uh, for that amount of dust is get, you know, something like a, a little toothbrush, kind of clean it off. You feel what I'm saying? See, uh, eventually, uh, I like this this ASR I'm keeping, but if I ever wanted to, if I wanted to sell it, I want to be able to sell it. Look at all this. Like this, this is for me. This is incredible. I I, I love the old stuff. They they're so they're flexible. They're I don't, you guys probably didn't see that, but there was some dust that just flew off. <laughs> look at it, look, 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 on the inside, Sony <laughs> made the metal, like, I guess they infused the metal with their, with their insignia. <laughs> That's kind of cool. But like I said, on the inside of here, you got, there's, there's like, like I said, there's like a grease. You don't want to remove that grease, but you do when you clean this tape head. You want to get in there, clean that tape head, and look. Here's another good thing to do with floppy drives, too, which I know a lot of you guys are like, Floppy? What's a floppy? You young whipper snappers. Oh, see? I don't know if you heard that. That was the can pretty much giving out. No air. Cool. It's cool. That's the reason why... I, I, I bought more than one can so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stop for a second and then I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and basically I'm gonna go ahead and go get me a q-tip so I can clean the head I'm gonna show you how to clean the head with a q-tip um, then I'm gonna go ahead and finish doing the rest because I really need to get into the rest by now as you can see, that's dry. Still looking a little wet, but it's going to dry anyway. So, 
let's go ahead and I'm going to do two things. I'm going to remove the screws while, while I'm gone. And I'm going to grab a Q-tip. Then I'm going to pull it out when we come back. All right? All right. okay and we're back I undid all the screws right and then here's my alcohol like I said alcohol got a couple of q-tips uh, you see this one kind of a puffy head so that's kind of like really not, not all that great I try to stay away when I pull q-tips to do this type of stuff I try to stay away from the puffiness you want them like this. Reason why is because you're going to be adding a liquid to it anyway. And when you add that liquid, you're going to want, you don't want it to like get crazy. Okay? Now, let's get in here with that tape head. Now, see how it's wet? But it's still not like wiry. You don't want those like. You don't want it hairy. All you want to do is get into this tape head. And kind of clean that out. And then you kind of want to. Whoop, too much stuff in the way. Hold on. Hold on. I got you. I got you. Too much stuff in the way. Boom. Uh, there's another one on the black on the black piece here. See that? See that one? Yeah, you got to get into that, that too. But see, look, not that much. You kind of, I don't know if you can see it, there's a little bit of dust right there. But luckily, there's more than one side to this thing. And only because I'm doing this with one hand, it's the reason why I'm doing this this way. All right. Now, what are we going to do? Let it dry. While that's drying. Let's pull out this next piece. Luckily, we uh, when we luckily by now it should be dry from previous, from what we did previous. Got to look at check out the back. I don't know if you can see that, like right around here. There's like some black funky stuff. Not cool. Probably because uh. <sighs> I don't know it probably got hot <laughs> that's that normally looks like something from heat there's also at the top here some like cor corrosion it looks like not cool neither okay so what we're gonna do like I said we're gonna flip this over this way but we're gonna put this like this as we set it down now you already know I went through my first bottle of this good stuff but now I'm going for my second bottle of this great stuff and I'm getting ready to spray this stuff this way see it knocked all the q-tips down <laughs> So now, look at that. It's cold, man. It's cold. Right now, this whole thing is cold. It's a good thing. Wow. What am I going to do for that? I'm going to let it sit, but I'm also going to get a toothbrush. Get a little toothbrush, kind of knock that off. You know what I'm saying? 
let it cool down a little bit. I'm going to go get a two 